Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Brittany and for today's video we're going to be doing a review on the Tati Beauty Neutral Palette. This is what it looks like. It slides right on this thing. Super pretty. Oh my gosh. And it feels really nice. I'm sure a ton of you have already watched other videos um, on this palette. So this is what it looks like when you open it. So it is beautiful. And it comes with a very big mirror. Just rip this off. I'll just rip it off. This, the mirror is humongous. What are we going to do today? I don't really know what I want to do because there are so many colors. I will do some swatches on my hands. Um, and I think that's what we're going to do first. So there's four different textures. And then there's six different color categories. So the first one is memory. So that's the one I'll do on my hand first. The colors are so pretty. Oh my goodness. The next row is Ritual, and that's like the brownish. The browns. This is Ritual. The next row is called Story, and it's the orangish colored one. It is we're going to go into that one next. And again, this is Story. Pretty. Alright, and the next row is Soothe. That's that one. Okay, so now we're going to go into Aura. Super, super pretty. And the last row is Poet. That's more of the pinky, purpley row. And this is Poet again. Extremely pretty. Oh my goodness, all the glitters, all the glitters. Ah, look at my hands. They're also dyed. <laughs> all right, so I already have my eyelids primed. But, I'm going to put a little more on there. And this is MAC Pro Longwear Paint Pot in the color Soft Ochre. So, then, I'm going to go into Aura, and I'm going to do the matte. I'm going to go into this color. And I'm just going to put that all over my eye. Oh, it's super pigmented. Wow. It covers up. Honestly, my primer is too dark for my skin. This just lightens it up so it's literally the exact color that I need. That's a really smooth. Okay, so I did get a lot of kickback from it. But I'm good with that. So I kind of want to go in with the color Aura again in the sequins texture. So just the one right above it. And I want to put that all over my lid as well. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. It's very pigmented. Oh, it's so pretty, though. Wow, okay, don't dip into it too hard. I literally dipped into it super lightly and it is all over the place. It makes your eyelid look so smooth. Literally the tiniest 
amount. Super, 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 super pretty. I am going to go now into Soothe in the sequence color as well. That's this one. I'm just going to put that in the crease. And again, don't tap too hard into these because they're so soft. They're so soft, but they're blending. This is blending really seamlessly on my eye. I have never been so excited for a palette in my whole life. Tati is like one of my favorite YouTubers. So far, all three of the colors that I have used are beautiful, blended so nicely. Wow. So now I'm gonna go in to, I'm doing this a little weird probably, cause I'm so excited for this. I wanted to see these sequin colors. So now I'm gonna go into Ritual and just into the matte color, which is this one right here. So I'm gonna just go into that and again, just put it in my crease. don't have any fallout yet besides I do have some of the sequin glitters on my face. I am really feeling the new Selena Gomez, what is it called? Lose You to Love Me song. It's so good. Still go into the dark brown. I'm gonna just deepen this up. Alrighty, that looks really beautiful. I'm gonna go in with the sequin color ritual, this color. I'm just gonna dip into that, oh gosh, sweep it over the top. Now I'm gonna go into the matte black called Memory. I'm gonna just dab that on my, the outside of my lid. It's a nice black. And I kind of am a little messy right now, but it's fine. It's okay. I'm going to clean it up. I'm going to clean it up at the end, so don't worry. So I'm going back into the matte brown in Ritual and just kind of deepening it up, but also just kind of blending it in to make it all look really nicely. So it all looks really smooth on my eyes. Okay, that's a little bit better. Always with sequins and um, glitter eyeshadows, I always use this glitter glue by Too Faced. So I'm gonna use that as well. Honestly, the metallics aren't like crazy 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 metallic so I think I'm just gonna go right into the glitter and I'm gonna go into ritual this dark one Ooh, that is super pretty so the glitter shades are so pretty I think I'm going to go into Soothe, the glitter color as well, right here, and put that on top in the center. Ooh, I really like that color. <gasps> Ooh, I like that a lot. That's so pretty. That is so pretty. Okay, and then I'm gonna go into Aurora, the um, metallic color. That's this one right here. I'm gonna just put that in the inside of my eye and probably up here. We'll try her out.
That is beautiful. All right, and I'm going back into Ritual in that matte brown just to, just to deepen it up again. I'm gonna put more of the Aurora, the Aurora sequins color right here. Then dipping back into Aurora in the metallic color. Just want to put this a little bit up there. Wow, the glitter looks really pretty on my eyes. I really like it so far. And it's super smooth, like the formula. The mattes are so smooth. And I don't... This sequins formula is probably the most unique to me it's so cool it just puts like a like it looks smooth it just makes your eyelids look smooth very very smooth all right so i'm gonna be right back i'm gonna just do my whole face and then we'll come back and finish up the eyes and we'll be right all right, so I have my face done. So now I'm gonna finish on my eyes, but first I'm gonna spray what we already have done with the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. All right, so now we're just gonna finish up the eye look and we're gonna put, we're gonna go into the Ritual Matte color that I have on already. What we're gonna do is take that big fluffy brush and we're gonna go into Soothe and into the sequins color. We're just gonna put it underneath my eye again and hope that it kind of blends it a little better. We're going to put some black up in here. Risky. So I'm going to do the matte black in memory and just and then I'm going to go into the aura, into that metallic color again and just bring it ooh. I think that looks really, really beautiful. Okay, so we're gonna spray it again. Mm -hmm. Spray. Put some mascara on. For the top lashes, I always use Too Faced Damn Girl. And then on the bottom lashes, I always use Too Faced Violin Sex. Ooh, oh my gosh, this is beautiful. Wow, that's so pretty. For my lips, I'm going to go in with the Huda Matte Lipstick in the shade Anniversary. Looks like this. Let's go put that on my lips. Huge fan of that lipstick, and then I'm gonna go over it with Bare Minerals lip gloss in the shade Totally. So it's just a little nude color. All right, so this is the finished look with the Tati Beauty palette, and it is so beautiful. I love it. I loved all the shades that I used. All the formulas were so amazing like oh my gosh the colors they're all just so pretty oh my gosh ah! the color scheme this is just perfectly this is just honestly I think this is like one of the best palettes like first palettes to come out with and since it says volume one on the package 
we're all assuming she's making another one. And honestly, the packaging is really nice. I like it. It's definitely going to get dirty fast, but it's so pretty. I like it so much. Super blendable. I love the glitter formula. It's really nice, but I think my favorite formula out here is that sequin matte shade. It's so pretty. I love it so much. So beautiful. Please let me know what you think of this look and if you have the Tati Beauty eyeshadow palette or if you're gonna get it. Um, I would love to know your thoughts on it as well. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more from me, please subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.